Hey there folks, uh, this is 639 here and welcome to my channel. So we are about to uh, kick off uh, Battle Rai Esport once again and uh, my tournaments are about to pick up once more. So this here is an invitation to the open house, uh, pretty much it's like a housewarming event. Um, I've been working on the Discord clan for Battle Rai, uh, as you guys know, like the old players uh, there was a server uh, called a nil server and a uh, bunch of guys were in discord and they would like queue up in discord using a discord bot and um, do their custom matches and stuff so that's the same thing I'm gonna set up for everybody uh, and the difference is like you don't have to be a champion or grand champion to participate uh, it's gonna have casual queues and uh, rank matches and eventually we're gonna have a, a, an in-house tournament system where you can just automatically sign up inside of Discord and you don't have to go to a third party uh, website to register and stuff. So um, the website you guys are looking at right now is uh, smash.gg and you guys can go here and uh, register. Um, this eSport event is for Battery, Battery Championship and um, it's going to be broken down into several uh, sections, uh, several days uh, where uh, teams will compete will compete against each other and will qualify for the final event. And I'm, I'm going to set it up like this because uh, having all of these events uh, in one day is going to be a little bit hectic because I want to be able to like stream and uh, do some commentary. Uh, and get people to actually watch these players. Um, I don't want anybody playing in the background and you guys don't get your play on the, on camera and stuff. So I want everybody to have some uh, screen time. And so we're gonna break these up into uh, various days. Uh, the qualifiers will have one days between them. So uh, eSport agents can have time to take a little bit of a break and then the next day they can uh, meet the next team and stuff like that so we need a lot of people to sign up and so that it, they uh each day can be enriched with a lot of teams uh broken up competing against each other and stuff uh so this website uh when you come to discord or gg this is the home page you're gonna find um you're gonna find a uh tournament title six player arena esports there's a Discord link to the current Discord uh, that I'm setting up uh, Discord by for. Um, you're going to see the date when the, this event, the first uh, match is going to be between uh, teams and stuff. And where is it taking place? Online. Uh, you don't have to be in person anywhere to, uh, to participate. You can participate from your home. And a little bit of a description of what the uh, tournament is about. Uh, so this is eSport tournament um, is uh, open house invitational uh, event for the remaining incoming battery community members and incoming uh, battery community members um, there will be drop drop by skis uh, for people who are participating or viewers um, hopefully we can get drop by skis in there uh, first place would take 90 bucks uh, and the uh, prizes goes on uh, so below there is my twitch account i mean my twitch link and everything um, these are the events these are the qualifier events okay so the finals is uh it's gonna be on the uh on the 13th on friday and you guys uh, don't have to worry about this uh because I mean, you don't have to really register or whatever for this because like you'll be automatically uh, seated or whatever. Um, it all depends on those who qualify um, after these three. These are the three main events that you guys should be checking for. Uh, so you guys want to register for one of these uh, dates so that you can participate and compete against other teams. Um, you don't have to register. I mean, you shouldn't work, register for two dates because uh, yeah, you can only you should only register for one day because uh, that's like it's a one-time thing. All right, so uh, qualifier one 
it's gonna be on uh, on I think on Sunday, and then uh, Tuesday is gonna be the next, and then the next is gonna be on Thursday, and then right after that on Friday it's gonna be the uh, finals. Uh, so I hope I've uh, explained this and made it a little bit simpler for people who don't know uh, uh, Smash the GG or what uh, these tournaments are gonna be about or how they're gonna take place. Um, further questions you guys can find me uh, in discord so I can answer your questions and stuff and uh, I know just a little bit of uh, a quick overview here there are some rules and stuff and the rules are, are as follows uh, it's a best of five matches and each match is a five round match um, so it's gonna be a long day uh, for most of these events like you guys are gonna have a lot of matches uh, against each other and if you guys draw um, I don't really think it's there's gonna be a draw uh, in five but yeah I'm probably gonna edit this uh, anyways no stream sniping that's a rule uh, this is also a big rule um, no giving up uh, so as for the giving up part uh, if you find yourself with a 2v3 uh, situation you should always uh, continue fighting unless it's like 1v3 and you are like 20 hit point then you can give up if you want to but it's always encouraged uh, I already always encourage people to keep playing because you don't know when you can like turn a match around uh, you might have like an ultimate that can like just burst people down and just take them out and stuff and those are like the big plays that's why I encourage people to keep playing because in those tight situations that's when people can pull off the big plays and they can uh, make play of the game park matches and stuff like that uh, events all right so uh, for is now allow if you are submitting a uh, result for your team um, this here is from uh, this rule is from uh, Battlefy. Um, there was a setting in Battlefy where uh, captains will like submit the result of the matches and stuff. Um, so if we happen to have a situation where like we cannot record everybody, we cannot stream everybody and uh, get direct information on everybody's uh, result, uh, captains will have to turn in their team's result. And cheating is not allowed because if you cheat, you're going to get disqualified. Uh, you must respect your host and broadcasters or broadcaster. And as for teams, the teams must be checked in. Uh, they must check in with me, uh, the captains, uh, at least like 5 or 30 minutes before the match so we can know that everybody is there and ready to participate. Uh, teams can have one sub. Uh, even though like the sign up is like three three members, you can have like an extra and just uh, if the person have to like replace somebody else, you can let me know and stuff like that. Um, this sub cannot be sub for like two different teams too. It, the sub can only be a sub for one team. Um, I hope that that makes sense. Uh, teams are allowed to pause the game one time. Uh, if somebody have to leave for like ten minutes or whatever, uh, you can pause and wait for that. And then there are the payment methods. Uh, captains, if there are any rewards for the winners, you are responsible within 48 hours, pretty much like a day or whatever or two, uh, to come and get a reward. Otherwise, the reward will be canceled. Um, I've had a situation in the past where like somebody came to me like a week or like three days later um, looking for the reward for that team. And it was very hectic because um, I already told them that it should come for that reward like after the tournament and stuff and I don't have to like chase them and stuff like that so that was a bit of a crazy stuff uh, yeah the person in name is Blackie uh, you, I'm sure everybody noticed even like if you guys uh, were in my tournaments in the past you guys already know this person uh, so all team members must be uh, um, online to collect their individual rewards okay uh, yeah, to avoid troubles like uh, you know currency conversion uh, maybe I will, I will give like USD to somebody and maybe a teammate is from another another uh, 
region, whatever. And the person, the captain going to like end up converting the money and then giving the person a lower amount than they should be getting. Um, everybody's going to be paid in USD, no matter where you're from, uh, because like in some country, USD is worth more and stuff like that. So uh just just to be fair to everybody uh and stuff like that so uh players must have a paypal account uh this is kind of like a must uh i don't know how whatever other methods to use to uh give you guys reward and stuff and reward will not be given to members who are not present uh basically you have to be in the for uh 48 hours you have to be present within those hours so that you can get rewards and stuff. And if there are any more rules, captain will be informed and captains can report their team score and stuff like that. All right, so I see you guys can see here, it's a lot of stuff, uh, but I hope I've uh, simplified it, uh, explained it clearly to everybody. Uh, best of five, five matches, five rounds, and teams will compete and stuff. And if they draw, the captains can... Uh, um, I don't think this, there's going to be a draw thing here, but anyways, uh, I'm going to edit this. So this is my first time uh, setting up a tournament on uh, Smash the GG. So uh, there might be technical difficulties and stuff uh, within the uh, time where uh, teams are like signing up. I'll try my best to learn more about this website and uh, how to navigate uh, these tabs and windows and all of these uh, content and stuff in here uh, so while that's going on uh, you guys should sign up um, sign up requires a team of three so you need to have like three members uh, before you can sign up and stuff and you don't have to pay anything to participate in this uh, maybe in the future there will be uh, uh, a fee or a registration fee um, and then we can increase the prices and stuff and all that stuff. So thanks for watching. Uh, again, any question, come to my Discord. I'm right there, and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.